Hello everyone and welcome back. Today we're going to be playing some more Jurassic World Evolution 2. Uh, if you remember last episode, we first we got our first Demetrodons out and our second group of Demetrodons out and we are working toward a research center. Where's research? No? Where are you? Oh, you're in here somewhere. Really? I guess uh, maybe we'll go into here and go to search and check this out. Good. Building personnel to collect combined and store. Oh, creation. That's really not that helpful as far as uh, descriptions go. Oh. Yep. There we go. That'll work. We'll start that task, and we should be able to get up and going. Yeah, research following stage four gen. Advance the construction of the research compound. So no, we don't have to make one. This is the research compound. We're just finishing it up. Oh, it's starting to come together. There's a central courtyard. Oh, there we go. It's cool. That looks just like it did in the movie. Oh man, that's too cool. Like, I I expected some movie callouts, and some of these things are really cool. That's like extra cool. Magnificent. Biosyn is at the brink of excellence. Everything InGen aspired to be, and more. It is truly something. I I just just what? Well. This is the point InGen thought they had everything in place. Then it all unraveled from there. <laughs> yeah, let me put your fears to rest. I am not Hammond. He was all ego. I am not Mizrani and his tech-first approach. We are set up to succeed, and that is what we're going to do. Oh, no, I, I didn't mean to imply it that... No, no, no. I understand what you're trying to say. There is truth in it. But we're in a far better position to succeed because others have failed. Hammond and Mizrani both brought tremendous advances to the world. They just had a narrow vision of it. We do not. We see the whole picture. We see the balance of it. Where there are advancements, there needs to be a business that supports it. That makes sense. Look, Biosyn's not just interested in the dinosaurs. They have the potential to provide improvements for all life on this planet. If we don't jump on this opportunity, someone else will. So why not us? There we go, stage four genetics, one item up. We're looking for research on a very specific animal. If I were to say that its name means Olympus Fire Thief... A pyro raptor? Yes, exactly. Before we can proceed any further, we'll need to send a team out for pyro raptor amber samples. No problem. It looks like we should be able to achieve a complete, uncompromised genome with the Pyroraptor. That should make Dodson happy. Huh. Need to research more amber mine? Because I did not see that in there. Uh, research the following amber mine level two. Yes, that would do it. Oh, we got a new tab. Guess that's not a new tab. Never mind. Let's go down to two. We'll grab you, and we'll grab you, and that should be good. We need to send those other scientists off on break, otherwise they're going to cause some troubles. You, you. Ah. Looks like that's going to be quite nice. I don't know what kind of draw these guys are, as far as the park goes. Why are you still low on water? Anyways. Thanks. Likes, comps. Harmless. Infamy levels. So, current sale value 174,000. But no, this is this is not a dinosaur that would draw a lot of people in. That's okay. 
Uh, let's make sure we're on super fast mode because probably would have been done with the research by now if I had remembered to hit the button. Hey, research. We got the amber mine level two taken care of, so let's go down to amber mine level two. A Brachiosaurus, Triceratops, Velociraptor, Dimetrodon, Stegosaurus, Parasaurolophus, Stigmaloc, Lamimus, Saurus, Compsognathus, Parasaurolophus, Carnotaurus, Baryonyx, Atosaurus. I'm not seeing who we're looking for. Looking for Pyroraptor. Hurry. Research the following Pyro rep. Okay. We need to research those first. Pyro Raptor. Staff is busy. We don't have enough staff to handle that request, which means it's even better that we sent them on rest. Because if we hadn't sent them on rest, this last little bit would have pushed them over the top. We're just going to hang out here for just a minute while they finish up resting, and we're going to go research a pyro wrap. Oh, uh, we have a little bit of an issue here. We were waiting for the rest to complete. Where's the medical team? Ooh, right there. Medicine required. We need to research a cure for that ailment. And it looks like it's spreading like wildfire. Hmm. Task. Check on each. All of these. Okay. They should already go ahead and uh, do that during the normal stuff. But we need to search that Pyro Raptor to advance the storyline. We need nine. Oh. There we go. <laughs> Requirements not satisfied. Seven of nine. Not right. Oh, I guess that is. So we are short by one. We're going to have to upgrade our scientists before we can research that. We need to go back to research because we also need to search medicine. Uh, let's see. need to take photos of dino have issue uh, direct control oh that's not great where are you oh that's a lot oh free money okay mode Scanning. Where's one of these sick ones? Tuberculosis? Take a photo with the tuberculosis. Then let's back up. I think we can now go into our research and... We can research tuberculosis. Here, in prog process. Need three in the medical. Let's use you. Had a good amount of rest. And, uh, while we're doing staff things, go over to our staff center and see if we can level up some of these skills. Got a bunch that are unassigned. You don't have a whole bunch of anything, so let's uh, upgrade your logistics. Go ahead and pay for that. Up. Get your genetics up a bit. And four. I don't remember if training actually... Causes issues. Medics up to six. Yes, please. Let's train this last one in as we. Okay. So basically, everybody is busy doing things. Have more training. Training. Or, uh, legit. 
Because logistics is always yeah. Fit in fast fast mode. Researching tuberculosis. Yep, we got that unlocked. There. Uh let's see. Where's the medical response? Here. Add task. Can I add the task of the ring station? In. Nice. I guess I never realized I could do that, but it's, it's automatically going to treat everything in the area. Awesome! More research? And an, an inoculation against. Okay. Need five medical and logistic. Let's do those two. Sure. Get that researched up. And we also need to, should have been uh, in the research, gone for the Pyro Raptor. The are too busy, apparently. Still with our staff. What all are our staff doing right Uh, Unassigned, 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 unassigned. So as soon as they finish researching up uh, this node, the tuberculosis and uh, we should be go good to go on the pyro wrap. And unless something else happens uh, in that time, we're just going to uh, pick it up there. Okay, that research is complete. So they're going to be fixed here real soon. And we should now be able to research that pyro raptor that we've been trying to research for a good minute now. Okay, so we need nine. Uh, for is nine. Oh wait, I'm looking at the wrong column. Six, seven, eight, nine. And it's probably going to overstress one of our scientists, but it's going to be okay. Let's uh, see if we can make a uh, pyro wrap. Should come out pretty. And all of our tuberculosis is gone. So nice. Uh, let's see. Staff Center, are there any trades we can do for you? No, not a single one. I wonder if there's any other research we can knock out while we wait. So the Amber Mine uh, have 100 operatives. Can't do that just yet. For creation. Let me read what that is before I send folks off. Additional hatchery bays, advanced equipment, and one upgrade slot. Yeah, that sounds like a really good idea. Uh, let's see, we only need five. Or five. Well, let's not use you, because uh, you're wore out. And there, there we go. Get that up and researching at the same time. Might as well. I mean, really, we don't want to uh, overtax them. But we do want to get a lot of things researched as fast as possible. For our amber. Level two. Here is Pyro Raptor. There we go. Generalist is a bit over full. We only need five, so we're going to grab those two. We're probably also going to go back to the staff center, and we're going to send uh, Luis off on a rest. That should fix her up real nice, and since we're resting one, might as well rest both that are a little bit overworked. And when they come back, uh, we should have enough folks after that research completes to be able to increase the genomes. Yeah, um, I've been really enjoying this DLC. There we go. We got our research taken care of. We just got to wait for that, uh, that trip to come. Um, I cannot wait for a sandbox on one of the other maps with these invisible uh, fences. Wonder what other attractions that we can put in there. Maybe you can't use these invisible fences with attractions, but I would. I know it sounds like a terrible idea, but I would love to have people being able to just like walk by the dinos like that. It'd be so cool, especially like. 
T-Rex. Like, could you imagine there'd be no wall between you and a T-Rex? That would be terrifying. But that would be oh so cool. Let's take a look at the fossils we got back. Uh, so each of these with the feather seems to be Pyroraptor. We're for sure going to include this four. What room do we have? We can fit so many in. Go ahead and assign some scientists. And we only need three. So... Do the cheaper expedition. You're on that all by yourself, bud. And we probably also need to send out another um, expedition to go get more because my experience you always got to oh completed really Is there not another one did they shortcut a lot of the work i think they did i like the changes it's like a whole new game almost it was totally worth what i paid for it i forgot what i paid for it but it's totally worth what i paid for it but i should only be short by like one fossil from 100%. I wish I'd turned that around the other way. I feel like that angle would have been better. When you go in there, you're actually in this section next to this random guy that's pointing at things. I think he's in every one. Or maybe you're over here? I don't know how to choose where to stand in here, or I know you can't walk around. But last time I went in, I was standing right next to the show view. Oh, I don't see a shadow now. But last time I was in there, there was somebody in there with me. It was a little disorienting. <laughs> hey, uh, is at 61% fossil. Grab you. Some scientists. Yeah, you can do that yourself. We're at 60% after what we've already researched. We're doing really good. I really hope that we're able to bring all of these new advancements into a sandbox. Like, I'm so excited. Maybe we'll do some of that after we've finished this campaign. I don't actually know how long this campaign is. Need to speed things up again. I don't know what keeps uh, taking it back to... Oh, we keep going into buildings. That takes it back to normal speed. Um, yeah, I don't know how long this campaign is, but all of this stuff is in the game. We should be able to make it now. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's see, is there anything else we need to do while we wait? Take a look at our staff center, see if there's anybody that needs a rest. You do actually need a rest. Uh, train this guy. Research required. Okay, so we're going to have to uh, come back and try this uh, again, because he's already leveled up as far as he can go. Uh, is there anybody else that seems to be out of whack? Yep. Okay. Yeah. If we've got scientists that are, like, really good at one thing and terrible at everything else, um, I, I'm, I'm not sure that I, I like that. I like having more generalist folks that I can stick on anything. It helps me prevent myself from uh, overtasking them and causing them to uh, come out and sabotage us. The ranger team is just sitting there. I don't want to drive it around. I don't even know why there are gates if we don't need gates. We can just drive over whatever. Ah! These people right there beside it. We can go from one enclosure to the next like that. This would make so much of a difference. So many of the parks that I've built previously. Hey, where's the Dimetra? They're over here. And I went straight through that tree just now. If you saw the movie, 
Let me know down in the comments, because uh, these these Demetrodons had a scene. And I want to know if I'm the only one that jumped for it. I don't think I am. Uh, actually, my, uh, my movie-watching experience was actually quite nice. I, uh, I got to watch it in 3D with the, the moving seats. So, like, every time a dinosaur jumped out at you, uh, your seat would jerk. Here, the ever-loving mess out of me. Okay, en enough Jeep time. Uh, let's see. We are at 73% on the Pyroraptor genome. Can we increase it any more? Oh, there, there we go. There's more uh, Pyroraptor right there. And we just need five logistics. So, let's see. Cut, Q, and... Okay, cheaper expedition. Sounds like a grand idea. So ready for that. Because the Pyroraptor, if you watch the trailer, I'm, I'm doing my best not to spoil things for you, um, but if you watch the trailer, there is a brief couple of second long Pyroraptor um, clip, and that's literally all it is in the entire movie. Like, I was expecting a lot more out of that movie when it came to uh, all the cool new dinos, and it just it disappoints. Um, so, once again, trying not to spoil, but if, you, if you've seen the trailer, you've seen the, the Mosasaurus, the uh, big swimmy one, and it its only scene was the scene from the trailer, where it jumps out of the water and it uh, grabs all those fish. So, yeah, highly disappointed right there. Okay, fossil center fossils and let's get all researched up we only need three let's grab this uh, general list right here this low stress there we go and we're gonna sit here at extra fast and I know it's not gonna take too too long uh, but we're, we're gonna skip ahead till that's finished okay so, we still don't have 100% of the genome, so we're going to send them out again. We can get Pyroraptor that we can do? I think we're out of Pyroraptor. Or we get it up to 100% then. I am going to double check and make sure that we don't have... Oh, there we go. We have we have one final to research. Go. And we'll hit 100%. Okay, there we go. We finally have it fully uh, researched. I think with a little research, we should be able to get a batch of Pyroraptors ready for release. All right, then. Let's get a team on it. It may not be easy, but it is necessary. Can you imagine what would have happened already to this facility without us being here? I'd rather not. Me either. So let's stay on task. Biosyn needs us. And the dinosaurs need us even more. The pyroraptors are going to require an enclosure. Let's try and make it as suitable as we can for them. The last thing we need is for these animals to be irritated. Okay, so let's go ahead and get that built up for them. There we go. And I know we probably don't need a gate, but I keep putting in gates because that, that's what it taught us to do. Uh, it does not have power. You need to. Throw power. Yeah, it's a little bit out of... Good spot to put that. Let's see if we can fix up the environment just. And is there a button? Clean that up just a bit. We've got actual space to do things. Yeah, there. Uh, 
now we should be able to fit those in. Power. Does it actually say no power? It doesn't actually say no power. It's like all the other ones. That's okay. We've got those. Collect some eggs. We've got one of them that is good. Uh, let's see. Aggressive, bad idea. Aggressive and tolerant. No. Uh, social. That's good, but intolerant. Uh, that's, that's okay. And then more intolerance. Not a huge fan. But uh, let's go ahead and assign some scientists. We only need five, so let's... That's, that's probably the best thing about the unitaskers. Um, you can collect one to do a bunch. Uh, let's go ahead scientists and do more, though we only need so many of them, but with raptors, you've got to be real careful that they don't go below certain threshold. We'll, we'll pick these eggs out and uh, look at it at the time. I think we're going to call it an episode and release them in the next one. So let's go ahead and select and uh, we got one good one. Uh, and then we've got tolerant, aggressive, aggressive, and aggressive. We're just going to incubate the one and hope that it uh, it becomes the leader of the pack. So, start task. Okay. So yeah, uh, I will see you guys in the next episode when we release the pyro raptors into their new enclosure. I think it's going to be awesome. Looking forward to seeing you there. Well, it looks like that's going to do it for us today, guys. I wanted to say thank you for hanging around this long. If you did and you haven't already hit subscribe, please do. Uh, just so you don't miss out on any of the other cool stuff coming on down the road. If you'd like to hang out with us, please hit us up on Discord. Link is in the About section on the channel, or you can go to discord.onesnot.com. And I will see you guys in the next one.